we said under eye serum. So for under eye serums, you guys want to look for certain active ingredients that are specifically engineered for under eye, right? If you really want to be on your under eye A game, because if you use, a lot of people just put straight up retinol under your eyes, you have to be careful with that because it can cause hyperpigmentation, right? If you get increased blood flow to the skin because it's red, dry, and irritated, then that stimulates more blood flow to the melanocytes, the pigment producing cells, and then you get these dark circles under your eyes, and then you get darker under your eyes, and all you're trying to do is make your under eye eyes look better. So you want to have active ingredients that are going to upregulate collagen and elastin synthesis in the eyes that are also going to reinforce the barrier and that are also most importantly this is the kicker that not a lot of people know vasoconstrict the underlying vasculature so by putting vasoconstricting like active ingredients green tea polyphenols polypodium leucotomids caffeine niacinamide those will all brighten the, up the under eyes and then you mix that with other active ingredients that are going to upregulate collagen and elastin synthesis not so much like retinol or tretinoin like you would use on the skin on the face but also just active ingredients that are specifically engineered for that really delicate thin skin so that's why i made my ecm eye serum by mdr because there really wasn't a good eye serum on the market even the skincare lines of medical grade skincare i loved and i prescribed as a dermatologist to my patients those lines never had like a really great eye serum and i feel like i had to like make and engineer my own and then that was the first mdr product that we ever had